Hello guys, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will learn how to make a 3D printed power bank that offers fast charging to our smartphone. It has a LCD display, two USB ports, and a Type-C port. We can charge this power bank using Type-C port, micro USB port, or a lightning port. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. First of all, we have designed the case for our power bank using Fusion 360. Then using the software Ultimaker Cura, we will prepare the key code for our 3D printed parts. For printing its main body, I have selected PLA black color. After printing is complete, carefully remove the 3D printed part from the base plate. And also remove the spotting material from the 3D printed part. Now for printing the body of the circuit, I have selected PLA white color. Because the combination of black and white color gives a decent look. Now carefully deattach it from the base plate. And make sure to remove the spotting material from the part. This is a tiny switch that will help us to press the switch on the circuit board. We will use 6 pieces of 18650 cells that are specially designed for power banks. Each cell has a capacity of 2000 mA. So for 6 cells in parallel it will be 12000 mA. And the main circuit I am using is QC fast charging power bank circuit. It has two output ports. First port offers QC quick charging and the second port offers 2.4 ampere output. It comes with a beautiful LCD display and a switch to active the circuit mounted at the side. First of all we will connect all the six cells in parallel so that we can get a constant 3.7 volt. Make sure to perfectly solder the positive terminals with each other. Now we will connect all the negative terminals with each other. Now apply a little solder to the circuit so it will be easy for us to solder. Make sure to connect the positive terminal of the cell to the positive terminal of the circuit and negative terminal of the cell to the negative terminal of the circuit. Now if you perfectly soldered it, then your LCD will automatically glow up and show the percentage of the cell. Carefully place all the cells in the case. Place that 3D printed tiny switch at the side. And now place the circuit in the case. Press and hold the side switch so that we can check our circuit is perfectly working before closing it. Now finally close it.
For charging this power bank, we can use our Type C port, micro USB port, or our Lightning port mounted at the side. We can see that it offers a fast charging to our smartphone. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe and press the bell icon so that you can get the notification of our latest video. Take care and see you in the next video.